Hello, Breaking Free Family. Coach Lizzie here. God bless you all. I love you all. I hope you all are having a wonderful day. I hope you had a wonderful weekend. But just remember that God is still in control no matter what's happening, no matter how you feel. Remember that God is still sitting on the throne and he is not going to allow anything to happen that he is not in control of. I love you guys. Thank you for tuning in so much to Breaking Free. Hello, everyone. If you have not subscribed to the YouTube channel, please do so today. Please hit that like button. Please hit that subscribe button. And please make sure you hit that bell notification. We love you guys and we'll love you to be a part of our family. My name is Coach Lizzie. I'm a certified professional life coach. If you would like one-on-one -on -one with Coach Lizzie or we like prayer, please email me at warriorqueen.55 at yahoo.com. Or you can go to my website at www.breakingfree in pd.com welcome everyone i have a wonderful topic i want to share with you all today i'm going to keep it short and sweet the narcissist the narcissist everyone the narcissist the narcissist the narcissist everything is about these people okay the narcissist will never ever tell the truth the narcissist will never tell people about their evil background, the evil under the mask that they are wearing, the evil and deception and deceit and manipulation and the disdain that they have done to you. They will never tell the truth. They will never tell people that they are the problem and were the problem and is the problem. Okay. These people will turn around and make everyone think that it's something wrong with you, but it's because they're hiding their shame, their guilt, their uh, low self-esteem. These people are toxic. They are dangerous. They're manipulative. They're controlling and very dominating. But they don't want people to know that. So they have to make sure that they blame shift. They have to shift everything onto you. They will never tell the truth. They will never tell the new supply, their children, your children, their bosses, the family, their neighbors, everyone they have lied to. Now, let me tell you something. The narcissist has to lie to everyone they come in contact with about you. They have to tell everyone that they were the victim. They were the prop. You were the problem. And because of you, they are where they are today. And the new supply stepped in like Captain Saver, you know, and came in to take care of them, to bless them and to pull them in. And you just mistreated them. And a new supply was their savior. Oh, yes, honey. They telling everyone that you were uh, so horrible that you were you wouldn't submit that you were uh, disrespectful to them, that you were rude, you were abusive, that you want to be the man of the house or the woman of the house and you didn't want to do what they needed you to do. And it's all a bunch of lies. I know. Look how many people fell for it. Look how many people drank the narcissistic Kool-Aid. I know. It's so uh, disrespectful. It's so rude and it's so humiliating. And you just cannot believe all the people that these people were able to manipulate, including a new supply and their children. This is to what I'm saying. These people will take this lie to the grave. They don't like you and they don't like being around you. They don't like seeing you because you make them feel uncomfortable because they know that you know the truth. They know that they are manipulative. They know that they set you up. They betrayed you and they used you. That's not the only thing. They steal your identity. They steal everything about you. They like to cook your recipes, cook your meals. They're watching you. They like to um, uh, turn a new supply into you, which they don't even realize that they're being groomed to be molded into you because everything that you did with the, the narcissist, now they want the new supply to do it as well. But the new supply doesn't seem to see that because, oh, They've been manipulated. They've been love bombed. But most of them know the truth. They know about you. They know what happened. And they are a part of the deception. These people will never tell the truth. The truth is not in them. The truth is not a part of their character. The truth is not a part of who they are. These people live a lie. They are a lie, will be a lie, and will forever lie. I tell you. These people will do whatever it takes to protect their fake persona. They'll do whatever it takes to protect that mask. They'll do whatever it takes. They will destroy people, families, jobs, reputations. They will destroy their own children. They will destroy their own marriages and relationships. If anyone comes in the way or getting in the way of them and that mask, that mask is their life. Their mask is who they're hiding behind. I tell you, these people will never tell the truth. 
Don't expect it. Don't look for it. The best thing for you to do to accept is to accept what has happened. Know that God still sits on the throne. God's timing is perfect. He will always expose these people and Decepticons for who they are. You got to remember that we all have a Judas in our life. And the narcissist was our Judas. Just like Judas deceived. he did, I'm sorry. He didn't deceive. Deceive. He um, betrayed Jesus. He betrayed them. And the narcissist has betrayed you. They have betrayed me. They have betrayed everyone that they come in contact with. Everyone in the narcissist's life is a pawn. And they are controlling the behavior and the outcome of every relationship and toxic entanglement that they are involved in. You have to remember that the narcissist has to be in control of everything. Control of how everybody view you, how everyone views them, how everyone sees you, and how everyone sees them. They play the victim all the time. It was never their fault. They were perfect. They did everything they were supposed to do. And now they're putting on this face persona and this fake mask in front of the new supply, pretending like they they cook all the time and scrub all the time and they're working their behinds off and they're at their beck and call. It's all so the new supply doesn't see what's under the real mask. But that's not your problem. It's not my problem. It's the new surprise problem. And now the narcissist is their problem. So I just want to stop by and let you know today, everyone, that the narcissist will never tell the truth. Not that you didn't know that. Not that you didn't think of that. And not that you didn't realize. But I would just want to come on to remind you and to refresh your memory to just not even expect the truth out of something that doesn't know what the truth is. Thank you so much for tuning in to Breaking Free with Coach Lizzie. Again, don't forget to like. like Subscribe, hit the bell notification. Thank you so much for taking the time out to listen to my content, to share it, and I pray that it resonates with you. Remember, if you would like to donate to Coach Lizzie or you want a one-on-one -on -one session with Coach, or if you would like to have prayer, please, my information will be in the description box down below. Until the next video, remember that the truth is the truth. And remember that we are the originals. Nothing can change that. We are God's chosen people. We are God's chosen ones. We are empathic. We're loving. We're kind. We're worth it. Amen, everybody. Live your best life. Enjoy life. And know that the narcissist was just a lesson in our lives. The narcissist has walked away from their favor. They have walked away from Proverbs 31 wives. They have walked away from kings that God has put in their life because they didn't recognize nor care about how valuable you were. But one day they will. Have a great day.